Hey guys, welcome back once again. Um, making another video here, just doing a little bit of weathering. I got some new cars, so I'm gonna show that to you. Uh, I apologize it took me so long to get back to your comments on the other video. Um, I had kind of a crazy, crazy week uh, this weekend. Uh, I was down in South Carolina, had a couple of lacrosse games, um, so didn't really have a lot of time to respond to YouTube comments. But anyway, here I am again. Um, I have a couple of cars that I've already weathered up for sale, so you can see. Uh, here is one of them. This is one side. Um, you can look at the trucks there. I kind of I like the effect that I got with the the wheel sets there, um, with the with all the grime wiped off of the wheel face, the rim there, as if it went through a hump yard or something. And let me move this guy. And then here on this side, you can see uh, kind of more of the same. Did a little bit of graffiti based on some prototype photos. Um, Again, kind of the same stuff, a little less on this side, and I think this side turned out uh, much better, pretty clean, but all I did on this, I don't know if you can tell, but there, I did an acrylic wash uh, at first just to give it kind of like a dirty, grimy, rain-streaked wash, and then um, used some oil paints for the rust streaks and a little bit of oil paint for some uh, hammer dents and scratches and stuff on the lower portion of the car, and then I used some weathering powders to do some streaking and stuff. Um, and sort of the same stuff for the underbody and the trucks as well. So this is for sale. I'll post the link below. Uh, it's on my eBay page. Got a few days left on the um, auction. So go ahead and take a look at that. Um, honestly, this is one of the better cars that I've made. I really like, especially this side. I really like the way it came out. Um, I took some photos outdoors. I'll post those right here. Um, and I think it looks really good. Um, and pretty uh, pretty natural weathering. So I'll go ahead and move this guy out of the way. Uh, the next car that I did is this uh, BNSF gondola. This is an, both of these are Atherin cars, by the way. Um, the far car still has plastic wheel set, so I apologize for that, but that's just the way I got it, and I don't have any extra wheel sets laying around. Um, so anyway, factor that into, uh, I don't know, what you might value it at. Uh, this is a, an Atherin car as well, um, a more recent, run it has metal wheel sets and knuckle couplers um, it's kind of hard to see it's really subtle I went for there's this one photo I found um, a pretty faded car but it had this kind of soft edge uh, rust effect on it so you can kind of see that here it's much better in uh, natural lighting so that's why I'm trying to sit by the window here um, but there's definitely some rust under there uh, with some dusty uh, faded grime down the sides I also did a few patches on the side um, I did the trucks and the wheel sets the same way I did the other one. I really like that effect, the way it came out. And uh, just kind of rusty all around. The inside of the car I think looks really good too. Um, I didn't put any like garbage or anything in there. I'll leave that up to anyone who wants it. But it looks super like oily and stained. Kind of more of the same obviously on the other side. Uh, just did a smaller patch down here in the corner. And that is that car. So anyway, if you guys are interested, again, the link is in the description. So go ahead and check these two cars out on my eBay page. They're for sale. And then I will be, you can see all my weathering garbage over here. But I picked up a bunch of other cars that I'll be weathering. So we have an ADM 4-bay um, covered hopper from Atherin, obviously. Also got a Scale Trains uh, kit. These look really exciting, and I like uh, this um, Willamette End Industries uh, paint scheme. I like that green color. I uh, also got an older Western Pacific boxcar here that I will be weathering up, doing some heavy fading on that and probably a little bit of graffiti because um, I have some graffiti decals, might do some freehand stuff as well. And then a rail box car. These, I really like these and uh, I've never weathered one, but I think they can turn out really well from uh, what I've seen from other people. So I'm excited to do that. And then. Um, actually, yeah, that's it because that's a car I already sold. So I got these four cars that I'm going to be working on. Those will be up on eBay. So anyway, sorry for the, uh, it's not a super intriguing video, nothing with the layout, but just wanted to update you guys, show you what I'm working on. Um, and I'll have a video soon because there it's fewer than or less than two weeks until I'm back at the layout. So I'm really excited to get back and uh, get working on, on some more stuff around the layout. So as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to keep working on these guys, post them up on eBay, and uh, feel free to check them out. And, but if you don't, until next time, I'll have a video very soon. So thank you guys so much.